Hi, we are going over properties of triangles. My learning target is I can determine if side lengths can form a triangle and find the missing angle. So first we are going to talk about the triangle inequality theorem. And this is when the length of the two shorter sides of the triangle must be greater than the third side. So that means short side plus short side needs to be greater than the longest side. So we have four plus six, or four, six, and eight is my three side lengths, and we're going to try and prove if this forms a triangle. So my two shorter sides are four and six, which equals ten. Is that greater than my longest side, eight? Yes, it is. So these side lengths do form a triangle. Then we have determine if the given side lengths can form a triangle, 2, 3, and 7. So I'm going to take my two shorter sides, 2 and 3, add those together, and we get 5. And that is not greater than 7. That's not true. So these cannot be the sides of a triangle. All right, then we're going to talk about the angles. In a triangle, all three interior angles, that means the angles inside the triangle, add up to 180 degrees. So angle A plus B plus C equals 180 degrees. Um, and then we have where that we have this line right here. A line is one, a 180 degree angle, and this proves that all angles in a triangle add up to equal 180 because we have C, and this is congruent to angle A and angle B, and they all add up to 180, and that's how we prove that that is true. So example number one, we are going to find the missing angle. So that means that we have 45 degrees plus 90 degrees plus this unknown angle equals 180. So you would solve it like a one-step equation. So 90 plus 45 is 135 plus this unknown angle equals 180 degrees. So subtract 135 to create your zero pair. So my unknown angle is 45 degrees. Here again, we're going to find the missing angle. My missing angle is 30 degrees. Okay, we're going to practice these. You can go ahead and pause the video and practice these problems, and then you can push play and then check with my work. So finding the missing angle, we have x plus 80 degrees plus 60 degrees equals 180. Then we have determined if the given side lengths can form a triangle. So 5 plus 8 is that greater than 10? Answer is yes. This can form a triangle. We are going to find the missing angle again for number 3. So my missing angle is 30 degrees. 
Determine if the given side lengths can form a triangle. They cannot. Number four, find the missing angle. This symbol right here means 90 degrees. The missing angle is 20 degrees. And then last, determine if the given side lengths can form a triangle. Yes, they can. Thanks for watching.